There you are. Jesus, I've been looking for you for ages. We have a bit of a problem. Are you listening to me? Is everything okay? No, uh, I seem to be a bit stuck. Stuck? Yeah, the sequence isn't working properly. I'm trying to turn around, but I just keep facing the, ro the wrong way for some reason. Okay. Yeah, hang on, I'm just gonna try this. Alright, did that work? Um, it's a bit hard to tell from this angle, to be honest with you. Listen, I can just walk around. No, hang on. I'm just gonna try one other thing. There. That seems to have done it. Now, what did you want to talk to me about? Oh, um, it's just to do with the dialogue and the lip syncing still not being sorted out. Listen, I already told you, we just don't have the time to get that finished, okay? We've got more important things to concentrate on. The um, the sequences are still all out of whack. we still got to go check on them and try and salvage something out of them, alright? So that's the main priority at the minute. season of Game of Thrones yet? No, not yet. I'm uh, really looking forward to it actually. So, just to get back to the lip syncing for a sec. No, listen, I'm just wondering, how are people supposed to tell which one of us is talking? Uh, look, we just have whoever's camera left come out of the left speaker, whoever's camera right just come out of the right speaker. Alright? Yeah, I guess. Here's the sequences now, alright? So, as you can see, some of them are working okay. They seem quite big, don't they? These ones are going to be used for the faraway scenes. Some of them seem to be moving quite fast as well. They're at 25 frames a second. We, we're going to drop them down to 15 frames a second once we actually start putting them into the film. So what do you think about them? Yeah, I can see why there's some problems alright. Turning one isn't working. But I think maybe the pointing one and the looking one could work quite well together. The uh, pointing guy could be maybe describing the potential for the space, sort of showing them where things could go. Yeah, I don't know if it has to be that limited, you know, just because he looks like he's pointing doesn't mean that's how we have to use him. Well, what do you mean? Well, he could be doing anything, he could be drawing sort of crazy light shapes in the air or, I don't know, something a bit silly like you know shooting lasers or something out of his fingers shooting lasers out of his fingers what would he be shooting lasers at exactly so a, a giant robot or something yeah that'd be quite fun actually don't you think if there was some sort of big battle scene in the main courtyard between this guy who could shoot lasers and, and I don't know, a big giant robot or something. <sighs> Look, I've got some other stuff that needs sorting out. So, I'm going to head off and do that. You just stay here, okay? And keep thinking about your robots. Great. There's another mistake. Sake. So what's wrong with it now? Huh? Oh, it's just the uh, audio on this one is messed up. Doesn't sound like too much of a problem. If it's just the audio, we can re-record that in a few minutes. Well, I 
it's not just like it's just this the audio in one scene. It's the fact that the whole thing is. I mean, like the not the model keeps yeah. getting knocked in some of the other scenes, and the lighting's off in other ones, and things don't match up. But I mean, like there's the silly excuse for why there's no lip syncing. It's just I don't know. Look, I'm sure it's not as bad as all that. All right, uh, we've only one more scene left to do. Yeah, if we do that, take a look at that, see how the whole thing works together. Maybe it'd be, maybe it's not going to be as bad as you think. I guess. Yeah. What is the next scene? Um, it's the fighting the robot scene. Oh, I, yeah, I quite like that one. Yeah, actually. yeah, I like that one yeah. as well. Okay, right, we'll, we'll just cut it up then. All right.